MGT, what it do, man? It's your boy, Movie Star, and I'm back again with another video. If you're new, you already know what to do, man. Become a subscriber, like the video. Thank you, appreciate you. And join MGT. This is a channel where I like to highlight current events and talk about my spiritual walk here in this beautiful, messed up, sideways blank matrix. Um, yeah, they starting to get the, the, C, the CDC or whatever, like the, the motherfuckers that control how you speak, they're getting on my case now. So, you know, I'm gonna try my best to eliminate different curse words fuck anyway um and this video is not gonna be too long uh it's just mgt quick thoughts i actually really want to talk to you guys about the use of our language for real for real from a from a standpoint of being on semen retention and um talking to different women or just you know what i'm saying or just being out here in the matrix bro we really do especially me and i think this is this is why like i guess i'm calling myself out by doing this shit but uh at the same time we have to really be careful of how we use our words with women because our words are a lot more uh actually holds more life force energy like the actual sound the vibration that comes out your mouth type shit like it holds the same glow that you have within your body you know what i'm saying to the average person that doesn't know anything about semen retention if you go seven days let's just say you go seven days without releasing What's gonna happen is, is your body is gonna transform. You might, uh, shit, two things might happen. Uh, your body might automatically be like, well, I'm used to releasing so much, so maybe day three of holding onto my seed, I'm gonna have a wet dream, you feel me? Or it's either that's gonna happen, or um, you're actually just gonna feel fine. Cause some, some people don't have wet dreams until like uh, 30 days into it, you feel me? But what's happening, dog, on an esoteric level, you becoming you are becoming more electromagnetic. Your words hold weight for real. Y'all can see in my videos, bro. Y'all can see in my videos. There's a lot of people, the CDC com uh, community, or you know what I'm saying, the holier than thou community, they come through and they feel it in their soul. Like when I say a cuss word. So they have to comment and say, man, your vocal language is really, yeah your words hold weight especially here in the matrix and you if you are holding on to your energy holding on to your seed doing things of that nature to pretty much um keep you high vibrational however sometimes when we are talking to females and we're chilling and things of that nature sometimes like when we start to flirt a regular conversation could turn could turn like uh south really really quick but a regular conversation we could be talking about something high vibrational, you know what I'm saying? We'd be talking about the birds and the bees, and then literally two seconds later, be talking about the birds and the fucking bees, if you know what the fuck I mean. You know what I'm saying? So, as far as you flirtate, uh, being flirtatious or flirting with different women and shit, just be very, very careful. Some things, some sometimes when you think that like you are saying something under your breath, or you probably said something to a woman two weeks ago, you, you probably might think like, oh, it went over their head. Like, okay, they didn't react. But y'all have to understand that words literally move energy, bro. Words move energy. Words change the energy within one's body. See what I'm saying? And um, you already being the quote unquote forbidden fruit, you already working on yourself. You already not being as available as most guys are. Because again, the more a guy is more available and the more guys, the more actually the more a guy is talking and available is the less attractive they actually become to a woman bro depending on the woman and depending on the situation of course right so so what's happening is um you having different simple normal interactions with these women bro to you it might be like okay whatever you're just talking and, and things of that nature but when you feel a woman flirting with you sometimes you probably want to flirt back especially like you know what I'm saying if she ain't causing no harm if she ain't doing nothing to you she's not making you feel low vibrational but sometimes conversations like that uh text messages uh texting after 10 p.m um texting at 2 p 2 2 o'clock in the morning bro you'd be surprised at how your reality your reality can change just by the words that you're using you know what I'm saying when you're interacting with, with okay if you're interacting with a female one-on-one -on -one type shit I almost got hit by that big ass a hornet. Um, what happens is 
a lot a lot of different like energy transfer is happening you feel me a lot of different energy tra transfer not just like with your body and your aura and your glow but also of course what you say how you say it when you say it you know what i'm saying and it's just the thing to think about bro you ever guys be like man I'm on semen retention. I'm doing what I do. Why are these females on me, man? Why Why does female want to chill with me? Why does female want to do this, do that? Bro, little do you know, again, your your words hold weight. A simple text message, a simple good morning, beautiful, how you doing, holds weight. I'm not saying to do that shit now because I'm, I'm, I ain't going to lie. I'm past that phase of just hitting women up saying good morning. If they say good morning to me, I say it back. But just like little stuff like that, you got to be very, very aware of because you might be attracting all kinds of women bro just by little things that you say sometimes a, mo a person can judge you off of your vocabulary you know what i'm saying so when it comes like i said when it comes to like flirting and talking to a female you go ahead and talk but be careful and don't be surprised or don't get mad when a female want to fuck and do all kind of crazy stuff to you because you 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 have a way with words you know what i'm saying you have a way with words you have a way with how to you know what i'm saying like make a female feel alive and make her travel just by having a conversation or even through a text message. That's that's real quote unquote sorcery or quote, quote, quote unquote magic, bro. If you know how to use the words the right way and use your energy the right way, you get anything you want in this matrix, bro. Like for real, you really can. You know what I'm saying? But it, it, it's all a balance. It's all like, you know, just knowing exactly what you are capable of, capable of doing, knowing some of your old bad habits and try not to retract to go back to that like all that shit is very important when you are holding on to your energy holding on to your seed doing what you got to do but um i'm not gonna make this video too long i want to say before i end the video too this is not gonna be 11 11 anymore like um it was it was a good run and shit but like now i'm just gonna let life run its course and stuff like whatever numbers come up it is what it is but uh let me know what y'all want me to react to type shit because again I'm, I'm gonna start doing reaction videos to uh different people who are different celebrities quote unquote who are talking about the same spiritual practices that i'm talking about you feel me i know i'm gonna react on kevin gates kevin gates got so many videos talking about semen retention like nigga you can put in kevin gates semen retention y'all can look that shit up yourselves dog honestly like you feel me i'm giving somebody else views right now you feel me i don't really need the views and shit but to some of the people who are new to the channel and shit y'all think like you know, I'll just be making shit up. Sometimes y'all, you know, y'all need to, I need, sometimes the things that I would say, y'all would have to go and like connect the dots and then find other perspectives on, you know what I'm saying, just the spiritual practice, you feel me? So let me know, y'all could, y'all could literally just send me the clips that y'all want me to react to type shit. Uh, I don't want it to be past like 45 seconds, like 30, 45 seconds. If y'all want me to know, because that way, I don't want to be re reacted to videos and y'all don't give a fuck about that shit, you feel me? So, but other than that, man, it's be your boy, Moody Star. Make sure you like, share, um, drop a bag on the, uh, <laughs> drop a bag on the cash app to support the team, man. Shout out to Boxer TV. I told you, I told him I'd shout him out type shit, but, um, or a dollar, whatever, you feel me? Ain't nobody lacking over here, you know what I'm saying? We just appreciate anything that you do. Donate to MGT, bro. We are growing every single day. And um, yeah, definitely like, share, comment down below once again. I'm gonna definitely see you guys on the next video. Um, there is something, there, there, there are some clips that I did see that I do wanna get my perspective on. But again, I don't wanna, I don't wanna be like everybody else. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna cap, bro. People who saying like, man, you should react to videos, this, that, and the third. Like my nigga, like, I'm gonna do a whole lot of shit. You feel me? Nigga, Moody Star himself, that's a whole, that's a whole entity right there, man. That, that, like, you feel me? But it is what it is. Shout out to all the brothers, you know what I'm saying, and the sisters that might came through and watched the video. There's love on this side. I'm definitely see you guys on the next video. Peace.